you need some coins to build that dream team you guys have always wanted, head on over to my sponsor, Buy Madden Coins. They have the cheapest, the quickest, and the most reliable coins on the market right now. Make sure to use code Poodle for 20% off at checkout. Hey, what's going on, everybody? It's Poodle back with another Madden Ultimate Video, guys. And today, I'm going to go on over the cheapest training that you can get right now in this game. Now, by cheap, that's an understatement, or should I say an overstatement, because it is not by any means cheap. Not even even close. Like it is actually way more. The list from last time, like if you watch my last video, it sounds a lot better. This video is crazy expensive, but everyone's been asking because I know everyone wants Marcus Allen, everyone wants ability. So I'm gonna be going over how to get it now for the cheapest that I answering 100 comments because it's a lot harder. Going over it, obviously this is not cheap. Do I recommend doing it right now? Probably not. But you can still get the prices if you have the coins and you want to do it. That's fine. I understand. I want to be evasive. Everyone wants to be evasive. If you don't want evasive, you're playing Madden wrong right now. But I'll be going over the cheapest ways to get it for now. But guys, if you're new to the channel, make sure to drop a like down below. Let's and a sub down below, I should say. Let's get to 5,600 subs today. I know you guys can do it. It's my birthday. Everyone drop a sub. Best birthday gift you guys can give a guy. Guys, let's get to 300 likes in this video. Comment down below if there's anything cheap that I missed. I love getting feedback. It always helps me out to improve my channel day by day. And also, guys, turn on the noti bell to get notified every time I post. We are at almost a thousand noti bell gang, so let's try to get that to 2,000 within the next week or two. I'd really appreciate that, guys. But let's get into this video. So first things first, I got the updated list here. What it's looking like, none of them are a lot of them are really tied. To be honest with you, I got it on my phone here. None of them really just stand out to me specifically in terms of training, but it's still it's still worth it if you need training. I understand. I'll be going over them anyways. But let's get into this. Okay, so let's head over to the auction block. So as you guys know, I got the list ready to go. Like I said, don't recommend buying trade. Don't buy a ton of training. At least if you want to get something done, that's fine. But I start with the 80 to 80 ones where I usually have the where I usually start with everything. I like to go from bottom to top just because it makes more sense in my head. So 80 overall is 14,000 training. They go for 190, I believe. So if you divide that, it comes it's like 68 training. I kind of rounded that a little bit. It's like 68 coins per training. It's the worst one. Don't even bother. Let's go over to 82s. Now, obviously, before I even give you, I mean 81s, before I even go into it, remember that although these might not be the best trading options, sometimes it's the best for you. Let's say you only have 60k coins and the best trading options are 90 overalls, let's just say. You obviously can't afford those so sometimes buying 281s or let's say you just need let's say you just need an ability like evasive and you only need like a thousand five hundred and you don't want to buy the three thousand training option you could just buy two seven hundreds because it'll be cheaper in the long run that's all you need instead of over buying training at this price i would buy just what you need now the 81s they go for about 15k ish if you divide that by 265 it's 64 coins for training this was like 54 a week ago they are crazy expensive do not recommend those either now next we got the 82s the 82s are 20k if you divide those by 365 which is the quick sell value you get 54 coins for training which is pretty good considering how madden is looking right now now <coughs> excuse me the 83s i believe the 83s are almost like yeah 29k just about yeah 29k 28 no 29 so 29k divided by 505 which comes out to 57 coins per training which again not that great there's obviously gonna be better options as we go up the list usually the more expensive players typically a good rule of thumb is the newest promo players that are high overalls are always gonna be the best training options so like when they drop heavyweights and they first drop the new ones and they're going they're going on the block for like 70 80k those are usually gonna be the best ones because they're under they're undervalued for their position so they're always gonna be the best ones so just remember that new promo drops cards are going up like wildfire on the block those are typically gonna be the best training options now coming into the 84s they go for 700 trading for 37k so 37 divided by 700 is about 54 coins per training so that is not horrible again like i said that's right there about like medium what the, the market's going for there's gonna be some cheaper options but not exactly not honestly the best ones now we go over to 85 which is all the way down i believe like 55k right now which is pretty expensive for an 85 they used to be a lot cheaper like i told you guys everything would go up after the game really kicked off they're going for about 57k so 57k divided by 970 is 56 coins per training so again not really the best one now we got the 86 right here let's see 86 is go for about 80k which would be 1340 training if you divide that divide 80k by that it's about 54 coins per training so again right about market value not what i would go for i think there's a few better ones now the 87s i'm not even going to bother telling you because the 87s are crazy right now they're like almost 100k don't even bother with the 87s they started about 100k I wouldn't even worry about those. Disregard those as even a training option. Now the 88s, clicked on the 86s. The 88s I think are a little better. They, they, they were the best ones, but they're, they're a little down right now because Tom Brady and them are going for a lot higher than usual. They're about 135 to 140K, so if you divide, let's go at 140 because 135 is a little bit cheaper. So if you go like 140K divided by 26, 2640, 
that is 53 coins for training which so far is the best one not by much but it is the best one by like a coin or so now if we go to the 89s i believe they're going for about 180k 190k so 190 divided by 3570 is 51 coins for training so right now if you can get an 89 an 89 card for less than 185 you're getting the best training value in the game easily if you can get it for less than 185 you're probably getting it about 50 to 49 coins for training which is not bad at all and now let's go to the 90s which are the final cards obviously they're going for about 269 270 if you divide that by 4940 it's about 51 coins for training so the two best options for training right now are the 90s and the 89s but they are very very expensive not everyone can just afford to drop 300 to you know 250 to 300k in training it's not exactly a viable option for many people even me right now i could barely i'd be all my coins so again that's not really the most recommended thing that i would do personally right now with the way training is looking so if we're going to recap it 80s are horrible 81s are horrible i recommend if you, if you don't have a lot of coins and you just need quick training like 700 i'd recommend buying two 82s or 184 if you, if you need like 700 to a thousand i'd buy an 80 like I'd, if you need about a thousand five hundred i'd buy two 84s if you need about a thousand i'd buy an 84 and an 83 now 82s and 84s are the best cheap option if you're gonna go cheap 82s 80 and 83s i mean 82s and 84s are probably the best option for you guys to go but if you're gonna go expensive you need a ton of training like you have to power up your whole team the best option would be about 89s to 90s depending 90s being 4940 and 89s being 3570 now like I said, would I recommend this right now? Not exactly. I don't. People have been asking me how to get a lot of training. I really don't have a lot of training. I kind of just powered up Marcus Allen. I powered up a few players, but they don't really have abilities yet because abilities are crazy expensive right now for the price that they go for in the market. So in my opinion, it's not exactly worth it. Would I do it if you needed evasive? Evasive is worth it. Evasive, <laughs> evasive for about 100,000 coins or 70,000 coins is so worth it considering that it just got me top 100 in weekend league, which by the way, guys, if you're gonna place if you're gonna place mvp ultimate legend mvp whatever all-star it's way worth it because you get your coins back so in my opinion evasive is a must-have whether or not you have it on top girl which i think you can get jukebox which they say jukebox is similar but it's not it's evasive so in my opinion the chems are definitely worth it i think team chems are worth it like lockdown defender really helps and evasive really helps that's why i have mahomes because mahomes comes in with built-in chems and remember when i said that these cards are the best card values in the game right now because they come in with built-in chems. So when Mahomes is 330, I said that he's the best value in the game because he comes in with built-in chems and those chems alone go for about another 150k. So you're pretty much getting Mahomes for 150k. Well, it seems like the market picked up on that because now they're all over 400k. I told you guys to buy them because I knew that once the market picked up on the fact that, wow, wait, if with if, if we need 150,000 training to even get these abilities, I'm practically getting Mahomes for 150. Yeah, Gilmore was pretty much, when he was 320, Gilmore was really only going for 140 if you think about it because the rest is all in training and chems so if you buy Ramsey let's say for oh Ramsey's cheaper than Gilmore right he's he's uh he's 180 let's say you're like wow he's 180 and then I can just power him up so now you power him up now he's like worth 250 270 and you're like okay well he's cheaper than Gilmore right yeah but in reality even though he's cheaper than Gilmore the, the abilities Gilmore gets probably goes for about 2,500 training so in reality maybe even more so that that training alone is almost like 200k so if you, if you really think about it the best values the best card bang for your buck kind of cards right now are the mud superstars which is why they're on my no money spent teams why they're on budget teams in my videos they are the best value. if you want any cards right now and you can't afford training i think the the best offset for that is to just get these cards do remember though you can only have three per offense and defense so don't go overboard and get too many but guys that's about it for this video i hope you guys have enjoyed i hope this helps you guys although it is very very expensive i hope you guys can make some use of this if you guys have been asking for this look overwhelming amount of comments Quick little bit of advice, guys, since I did just mention all those superstar cards that I'd recommend doing in case you didn't want to buy the training and it would be the best budget value for your team. Mahomes, by far, is one of the best ones when it comes to abilities. And D-Law and Gilmore, D-Law's D D -Law. D abilities alone make him one of the best ends in the game. Although, I don't think he has the best stats. His abilities are very crazy, especially when you blitz a lot. He gets that first. I think he has, like, edge threat, I'm pretty sure, one of those. And he gets right off the line pretty quickly. Stephon Gilmore is a shutdown man corner. So, if you're going to blitz... D Law and Gilmore together are a great combo. D Law, once Stefan Gilmore gets a shutdown badge or whatever you want to call it, shutdown ability, pretty lock. So, him with D Law and Mahomes, I love those three as a whole. Odell, too, is pretty good. But, guys, if you guys need to go into detail with them, just go look at them. They show all their stats. You can go do research on them. Maybe I'll make a video on them. But that's it, guys. That's about it. Hope you guys enjoyed. Hope this helps. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys are new to the channel, go down below. Comment if I missed any training values. If I was off on any of them, I'd greatly appreciate the feedback. Also, let's get this video to 300 likes sub to the channel if you're new smash the sub button let's get to about 5600 today hopefully and also guys turn on the notification notified every time i post a brand new video but that's it thank you guys so much for watching catch you guys in the next video